Good morning friends. I welcome you on behalf of superprof.com for a session on general science. Now as far as the topic of general science is concerned, you might be aware that this is one of the best or most important topic for the civil service examination in terms of clearing the preliminary examination. And this is actually one of the most elaborate topic as well. Over the years it has been observed that the UPSC has offered different types of challenges. Now when I say challenges, Good they morning, say friends. very simple I thing. I welcome you on behalf of superprof.com for a session on general science. Now as far as the topic of general science is concerned, you might be aware that this is one of the best or most important topic for the civil service examination. Now, it has become very important for a very simple reason that general science as a topic has a vast scope. When I talk about general science, the convention was that they used to ask question. They, when I say it means UPSC people used to ask question from the field of say class 9th and 10th NCRT books. But over a period of time with the increase in the science and technology, we can see the scope has, has increased like anything. Now we can talk about nanotechnology, we can talk about robotics, we can talk about say space technology, we can talk about defense technology. So actually the topic has merged. When I say merged, actually prelims and mains both have merged together and they have come up with a very elaborate system. Now any kind of question can be asked by UPSC. So when you prepare for this examination, it is very important for you to have a perspective with which you can club both the things together. When I say club both the things together, the simple idea is that you cannot separate prelims with mains. Prelims and mains can be there and can be merged together and in such a manner that we can actually do both the things simultaneously. Now this approach has got one particular problem and one particular opportunity. When I talk about problem, actually the scope becomes so huge that you can actually cannot stop yourself from going through on one particular thing but at the same time by going through this topic in a greater detail you can prepare for the prelims and the mains at the same time now what we are going to do we are going to do a session with dr ravi agrari who is actually the best known teacher one of the best known teacher in the field of general science and technology and it is our endeavor from the superprofs.com to bring to him bring him on our platform not only for the benefit of the students but also to put across the kind of quality that we want to de deliver to the students. The idea is that when we prepare for the examination we should have two three different aspects covered. First we should be in a position to choose our teachers in terms of we should be in a position to choose the best teacher for our preparation. The second important thing is we should be in a position to self-pace our study. Now when I say self-pace our study, superprofs.com is a technology company, actually it is the largest online test prep company and through this session we want to put across the kind of work that we have done over some time which the students can benefit from it. So what I am going to do, I am going to tell you how superprof.com works and how you can be benefited out of this. Now superprof.com has done a very simple thing. We have tied up with one of the best teachers that are available on this particular field and you know the kind of work we are seeing. And what we are doing, we are recording their classes. Now when we record their classes, what we do, we take these classes to the students directly and these students can actually choose which teacher to study from. And once they start studying from a particular teacher, they get the benefit in terms of not only choosing the teacher but also pacing their course. And when they pace their course, it means that you have a flexibility, you have a flexibility to define what you want to do, you, want, you have a flexibility to choose what topics you want to study. For example, not all of you would be weak in say polity or maybe say history or you may not want to study history at all. So this kind of a platform where the superprofs.com comes into picture that you can choose the courses what you want to study. You can repeat the courses over and over again. And the second aspect is that once you do it, you can actually read them or revise them over and over again through your smartphones or tablets or something like that. So this is one wonderful event where you can be 
following a teacher over a longer period of time in such a manner that you can define your preparation at your own place at your own time now when the motto of our company is definitely this exam made easy when we say exam made easy it also means exam made easy in the sense when you are in a position to choose the technology is the greatest enabler of our time through technology what we can achieve is that you can become the master of your own destiny right now i will transfer this session to dr ravi agrari dr ravi agrari will tell you that how to prepare general science and science and technology for the coming examination and an overall perspective about how to prepare for this once is through with this i will also tell you more features about superprop.com so i hope you have a wonderful time here and through this session you are you are in a position to do much better in your examinations welcome friends good morning to all of you and now the time came i am very sure you people were waiting about uh, my uh, discussion in this uh, webinar uh, definitely guys here i can see your all masses and uh, time to time i would like to discuss your all the masses here uh, in this webinar what about the concept of webinar i think so uh um, this nagin sir has already informed you see uh, again before going to start my all the discussions i would like to introduce the uh, myself and uh, even what about the concept of the webinar and why definitely guys i will like to inform you uh, why i associate with this online uh, video classes uh myself ravi agrari i have done my uh, research work guys in iit delhi and this time i am associated with the a uh, research scientist at the same place my core areas of the research it was a uh, renewable energy and uh, even i have already published a lot of the papers in the reputed journals uh, international journals and a part of this guys i uh, uh, have also joined the various conferences in the uh, last year i was in the paris especially in this uh, waset organization even triple i triple e have uh, some uh, conferences it is going to be in the december i'm also going to us for that purpose but that is my research part what about my in this teaching areas guys i would like to introduce myself here i have spent my uh, 13 to 14 years guys around 15 approx guys with you people especially to teach two subjects uh, one of course guys this is here that general science and the science and technology and the second part i will again meet you guys in this webinar session for the environmental science environmental ecology uh see what about the concept of this webinar you listen first guys actually this is those media guys through which i can connect to you people through online now your question will be sir why the online reason very simple guys this time these generations are very advanced you all people are going to use this laptop you people are use going to use the um smartphones even tab a lot of things and the another thing guys this generation is become very fast and always guys you know very well the next generation always will be very fast on the basis of technology on the basis of some new ideas and approaches even this is the reason guys you people know why the sachin tendulkar is not in the indian team and why the newcomers are there and even virat kohli is also doing good guys and some new and time to time you people are you go know very well about on the basis of new technologies and the new innovatives okay new research work is going on and see of course guys this is the reason i'm here in front of you through this webinar this is not my first time don't worry if you people were worry about it uh this is not my first time guys i will meet you time to time here okay everybody and uh, another part guys for this meeting to me guys you people should have to be come on the online only and here you people not have to waste your time 
because every moment of time at your home guys in your laptop in your mobile phone through the apps you people can listen me now here uh, i would like to discuss with you guys why this why this why this is the good guys why this media the webinar is good even through this online classes video classes why these are good listen guys first reason is guys in india peoples are mostly what 85% i told you guys in the rural areas but nowadays they were using the mobile phones even the chinese handset it created the it created a lot of the revolution then because of chinese handset at the cost of 3000 3000 rupees 2 to 3000 rupees everybody have a smartphones in this smartphone you can learn everything guys in through this seminar through this webinar guys i am going to tell you guys here the main important part is ki you all people can listen me here in your mobile phone and the tablet at every moment of time even in the in this uh, in the classroom program guys i always got in my life in the 13 14 hour in 13 13 13 14 years in my experience guys i always got the limited time every institution told me ravi you finish this one in 12 hours you just finish this the biology in the for 25 hours now why this number of hours is going to increase reason it is a different part of business and whatever you can say guys but here i am free to deliver my lecture on the basis of my own satisfactions and time to time this is those media guys where i can update if suppose within a month i got some new informations here i can give through my videos and everybody can listen me but what about in the classes in the classes guys first time you people have to join the class next time it is not possible to hear the same teacher but here if you people are going to take my subscriptions guys so three times four times five times you can listen me and the another part i am telling you guys i will give you my number and through the help of this number if any kind of the doubt you people have occur here so you can call me i will give you the particular time on the super props facebook page okay so this is the way and time to time everybody know in the upsc without the current affairs updations your examination will not be possible here in this aspect uh, listen guys i am uh, i can see you all masses on this uh, um in front of me in this youtube pages but see this time you listen me later on i will try to give your answers okay everybody fine in this session first of all i would like to give you the information how to prepare this examinations why the reason is because of this people will connect and time to time what about the reasons and everything i already discuss the best part you understood yes sir time to time you will come in front of me and you will update and the revise and definitely you will uh, through the help of various masses you will come in the month for the ones and all the topics will be discussed through the help of these webinars fine now here my first part of discussion will be how to prepare i think is not required right now you people know very well what about me and what about my purpose in this time i would need of space so i'm going to erase all these thing guys here in this session guys my part of discussion how to prepare first how to prepare after it guys i will come into the second part how to prepare in next two month there are two part guys how to prepare guys if uh, my statement is here in this period of time if you people are going to study this general science and science and technology so everywhere in every institution guys every teacher will tell you for the science for the science you should have to finish 6 to 10th standard of the book guys science book which book ncert book ncert book guys so first of all you should have to finish the 6 to 10th standard of the ncert book that is very very important okay after it guys second part will be my discussion you listen my lecture you listen my lecture my lecture will be here especially here you can find in biology physics and chemistry and of course the technology part this is the second thing guys and third time third thing is here guys current updations current updations without current guys your preparation will never be complete and currents you know it's a very big area guys 
it's very big areas but you should have to be proper discipline because here each and every things are not required for an examination what about relevant and what not in that cases i will help you the super props will help you through this help of these webinars i will inform you fine these are the three information even this prepare for the preparation guys how to prepare is what how to prepare is what the method is i'm telling you the channels why this channel because here you people can find me at a very cheap cost guys why cheap cost i'm telling you guys why it is very not very cheap you say it's very less cost why this is very less cost guys the first reason if you are going to take an admission if you are going to take the admission in any academy yeah, any institutions guys in that institution academy definitely you will pay more than 1 lakh rupees 1 lakh rupees and here you will find only a lecture for five and half month after it what nothing you go next batch will come and next batch will listen the way about, uh, about the lecture of the same teachers here what about the positive many times many times you can listen a single teacher guys whatever the subscription you can listen me for three times four times four times. now again here you maybe have question sir but here in that in that cases it was easy to ask the question from the teacher because teacher was in front of me in the offline classes listen guys you tell me in the 700 and 800 student batch how it is possible to ask the question from the teacher you tell me in this 700 800 students yeah 300 students yeah overall 100 students guys it is, is it possible to ask the question to the teacher no guys it is not possible same thing we are also doing here but here i am going to give you the opportunity you can call me in that particular interval of time periods so say everywhere you are going to but for that you are going to pay around more than 1 lakh 1.5 1.4 lakh that is the payment and here at the cost of hardly 12,500 this time you can listen everything and see another thing when you come in Delhi guys how much you pay around minimum 10,000 rupees a month 10,000 per month if you stay in Delhi for the six month only guys so you are going to pay 60 to 70,000 second thing guys and the rest of other you are going to invest so overall guys you are going to pay here 2.5 to 3 lakh minimum during your preparations and what will be at your home at your place throughout the india if anywhere you belong you can see you can listen my all the statements all the class discussion here through the help of what this internet programs this webinars this super props classroom programs and see here i will give you the phone number again i am telling you at the end of this i will give you the phone number and this time i will update on the super pros page you people can call me so overall same thing you are doing here but here the everything is available and that same teacher you can find in this particular course of time how much as you like you can listen me so how to prepare this is what this is the information and why and why this is this this channel i got it guys see when I was going to super props, many of my friends asked me, Ravi, why you are going to join the super props? I want to give you one reason, guys. Even some of the institutions was worried about it. Hey, Ravi, please don't take the class there. Here the people are not, are not available. I know, guys, the future of the super props. We are the first one in India who started to provide you. And listen, guys, you trust me within the six months and one, one year, guys, you will find a lot of the organization will start to do it. Reason, this is the burning topic, guys. This is the burning technology, guys. This is the future technology, guys. Each and everybody will use me, even listen me in your mobile phones. At every moment of time, if you are going anywhere in your bus, you can even enjoy your time. With you, can, you are not going to waste your time because you are going to listen me in your mobile phones, in your laptops. Inside the train, guys, I have seen around 10% people are using the laptops. 30% people this time I have seen in the every Shatabdi and Rajdhani guys when I go at my home 30% people are using something in their own mobile phone something in their own mobile phones In this 30% student if they are doing something in your mobile phone it means your 3G is working Here you can utilize your time with my lecture So this is my statement guys every moment of time in this UPSC preparation you can utilize And the another part guys I have seen when I will give you a book guys, this time you people feel very lazy. But you will, when you listen anything, you enjoy and you are going to grasp here. So here the thing is not a dictation I am going to do here. Here I am going to deliver the lecture. And here the everything is not in the form of the book you are going to read out. Here you are going to listen by the, by the certain persons who are the specialized in their own areas. This is my concepts here guys. Okay, mine. Now, how to prepare, you understood? 
your preparation will be what your laptops your tabs whatever and what you will prepare this is here the basics but see guys in this two months in this two months now the part is here how you can read out everything reason guys if you will come anyway this time your people cannot join the institution anything else guys so the better part you listen my lecture listen i will tell you one thing guys in my facebook page guys sometime the student told me sir your lectures are very lengthy sir why lengthy listen because in the case of environmental sorry in the case of general science total 31 hours are mentioned okay fine 31 hours mentioned i'm telling you yes that is the 31 hours in this 31 hours guys and see again i'm telling you but it is not complete you should know it in this month of around 20 to 25 this lecture will complete guys it is my own uh, uh, work and whatever i'm telling you is on that basis experiences this time about 31 hours there and this 31 hours is sir it's very lengthy 31 hours guys sometime i become sleep okay here i will tell you you have not any other options in this 31 and see in the future when i will complete my lecture it will become 45 hours with the current affairs update guide trust me here i will also give you the current and this what 15 lectures left now 15 hours 14 to 15 hours left now now you will ask me sir this 31 hours is very lengthy okay fine 31 hours is very lengthy you tell me guys you are going for upsc preparations and you want shortcut great job guys if you will take the shortcut here and not be clear in this examination so how much year you will waste one year how much time and how much the tension you will suffer you understood my statement is here in this 45 hours of my science overall the general science and technology part of discussion guys what here you can utilize maximum time in your mobile phone and laptop you are not going to waste and here i cannot take the chance that is the reason i want to give you everything what about the basic requirement for your examinations so this is the reason if you people will send me the message on my facebook yeah, anywhere on the super profs page sir your lecture is very lengthy so here i will tell you guys you people have not any other option you listen me because you are going to give the upsc examination the topmost examination of india guys beyond it you people know very well about no jobs and here you people are going to feel lazy please everybody's are running this time guys everybody is going to give their own maximum energy to clear this examination why you are going to lazy so it's your problem not my problem but i will be not lazy i want to deliver everything this is the reason here i will give you 45 hours if you don't want to read out so don't read but i will give you everything honestly and those people who know very well they know very well yes sir you you always try to give the best in the examination so when i will not feel that now i have done the best up to that period of time i will do the exercise i will do the exercise and i will do the exercise so please don't send me this message this is very lengthy you listen guys in this 45 hours you will find everything in the science and what about the science question in the last 15 the last 11 12 and 13 14 do you know guys around 15 questions from the science and the area is what biology physics chemistry and technology ha huh. in these cases of biology physics chemistry and technology here i will categorize guys biology here you will find around 7 to 8 questions physics and chemistry one or two questions technology around 8 to 10 questions if you want to left something in that cases i will tell you you left the physics chemistry you should have to prepare about the biology and technology part and this is the reason in the super pros my general science lecture science and technology part guys my focus area is the biology and technology maximum physics and chemistry even i will be lazy here because upsc is very lazy to give only one to two questions so upsc is lazy so of course my lecture will be lazy here lazy means i will not do the more lecture even in the case of physics and chemistry and even i will request you you can skip this part guys and you may have a question sir physics chemistry suppose this uh, one to two question came in that cases in that case i will tell you one thing you don't see the technology in biology you see only the physics and chemistry be mature guys last year the maximum number of questions from environmental sciences second was the uh, technology parts science and technology parts and third was the art and culture in this upsc syllabus are not defined so here you can read out anything but on the basis of experience of the previous few years question paper my statement is you should have to prepare the biology and technology part maximum here and the number of questions 7 to 8, 8 so what about overall 15 to 20 questions here Mac minimum i'm telling you 15 questions you will find from the science part see 
this is about uh, in this two month what will be my part of discussion guys what about main focus area main focus area you people see here main focus area in this main focus area guys one is the traditional part in this preparations one is the traditional part and second is what that is based on the currents currents updations in this traditional what will come especially biology part especially physics and chemistry part and what about in this and the technology part listen guys current if will come so it will come from the technology and biology and physics all this part guys especially i'm telling you the current will develop from the technology parts in the case of technology part guys which chapters are important which topics are important whether upsc asks the questions you see the categories of the chapters from the science and technology parts in the science and technology you will find the question from energy chapter you will find the question from space technology you will find the question for from communication technology you will find the question from information technology you will find the question from defense technology and you will find the question from biotechnology and a part of this guys i will tell you you will find the question from various miscellaneous topics these are the topics guys energy space communication information defense and biotechnology if you people have given the last year question paper you know very well there was a four question came from energy either in some of the options that question there yeah as a single questions i'm going to tell you the questions in this energy guys what was the question one question you see guys that was came from photovoltaics photovoltaics and solar thermal that was a one question one two three three statement was given in respect of india especially for the solar energy second part you see guys the question came from sale gas you just check guys sale gas was the question or not third part you see guys that was a question based on the neem plant neem plant is a source of biofuel or not actually the question came from neem neem is a plant guys and within the name one option was related to the bio related to the biofuel and another was given about the maize crop and written about the mage is responsible to provide the biofuel or biodiesel so there was the four questions based on the energy chapter you can see here see guys one thing this cell gas is what this was the current affairs and this cell gas question where it came i am telling you guys that came from the economic survey if you people have not the believe on me you just check the last year 13 14 economic survey i am not telling you 14 15 economic survey you see the cell gas was there and same all the statement which was given the economic survey came in your paper in this examinations directly guys fine my statement is here guys listen in this part i see this is not my lecture this is just to the inform you where is the science what about the science what should have to be apply in the science this is means lectures for the lecture you should have to join my classroom programs see uh, web, uh you should join my uh apps and you should have to listen me in your mobile phone and the laptops in this energy in this space in this communication information defense and biotech guys listen here basics always important basic information is very very important you all should have to be idea about the basics guys listen what about the basics generation of biofuel is what basics first generation second generation third generation fourth generation here you will not find the current affairs even in one of the test test, uh, test series guys carry a launcher i have seen one of the people have to carry this question sir first generation biofuel second generation biofuel third generation biofuel fourth generation biofuel was the question and here these the, the, this people this people have developed the question paper in front of this first generation is the ethanol or whatever second generation is this biodiesel or whatever third generation is the algal fuel fourth generation is the advanced biochemistry research work yes guys this type of the question is important to you that is basic here have not need of the current affairs updates even what about the solar panel what about the uh, wind energy what about the renewable energy here have not need the need of a current affairs but if you go into the nuclear energy what about the reactor work what about the uh, even the mechanisms how it work 
that is the concept that is the basics but what about the india us nuclear deal what about the nuclear liability bill it become as a current there it becomes as a current there even what about the problem this time going to be happen in the japan areas because of what because of the leakages of the various radioactive materials everybody know what happened in the japan when the tsunami came that is current affairs so my statement first you should have to be idea about the basics for basics you will find my lecture and see guys in the end of this under the technology guys i will give you the current affairs i'm very sure you people worry about the current this time because you have only two months listen guys this all the currents you will understand when you people have about the basic ideas of my energy discussion basic ideas of the space technology now it is what about the pattern of the examination do you know guys upsc is not asking this satellite sent from which place this satellite weight is how much this satellite purpose is what no guys you see and question paper 2011 2012 2013 and 2014 upsc asked the question why you say the satellite into the ghc orbit why the satellites are orbiting the uh, uh, earth why not fall down to the surface of earth why the lot of ions are in the ion mandal in the ionosphere guys why not fall down to the surface of earth this all the question i am telling you under the new pattern from 2011 onwards what about the comparison between the thorium and uranium this is the question which i am telling you from the energy and space technology even in your mobile phone also have a possibility to be the question in communication informations you know very well guys what about the uh, section 66a and whatever this time here this is the current affairs even it is a very simple question i have seen in 2008 or 2009 prelims examination which one is not the wire technology or oh, uh, wire technology wire based technology option was uh, uh, umts edge dsl and i think something more that was a dsl guys in your paper this is your standard listen guys in this webinar i will request you one thing even every time i request to all my students in my 13 years if you people will not see your question paper question paper you will not be in become as a is officer sir ab you will ask me sir why this question paper is much when you will read out the question paper you will understand through my all the super props classes Through, uh, through my all the super props classes now where you stand and how many number of question you can solve those people have listened me guys they know very well yes sir if you give me the lecture and whatever the discussions i got around 70% question directly in the examination if i will follow everything chapters is here okay one more part in this chapter i would like to tell you guys question if any question is going to come from the defense guys question is based on the contemporary issues if the question is going to come from the defense here you will find only the question from currents what about in biotechnology biotechnology is that part guys where if you people will check 2011 to 2014 question paper two to four questions average i am telling you guys three questions you will find on an average from this topic biotechnology i am telling you what about the maximum weightage in these all the topics see this is according to your prelims according to your prelims in the technology part these are the important part up uh, uh, in this mains examination have a introduction of science and technology development of science and technology in the ancient history in the medieval history in the modern history post independence so that is the part what about the research and development organization work in india that will be the especially for the mains examination even in this case about the ipr intellectual property rights some current affairs issues will be here but what about the issue with the basmati rice what is the meaning of trademark what is the meaning of the patent what is the meaning of copyright that is for the mains paper a part of these guys robotics nanotechnology artificial intelligence superconductivity laser these all are the main part but here this is the especially for the prelims which chapters should be prepared now Uh, one of the student even priyanka day asked me a question sir how many es question paper should even we people have to follow listen guys you should have to follow the question paper from 2003 onwards till 
2014 yeah from 2000 to 2014 you should have to see the question paper but your standard of preparation should follow the 2011 to 2014 reason this is the new pattern so your way of preparation your studies according to 2011 to 2012 but the question which already came from 2000 to 2014 you should have to see and you should have to try to solve it i know very well earlier the pattern was different so priyanka i have given your answer uh, now again i will give you the sum of the answer guys wait uh, now here i was the in the discussion part fine so biotechnology how much this is important around three questions okay see in this biotechnology you will find mostly the traditional part here rarely you will find some current affairs and you may ask me sir in biotechnology what about the possibility of the current affairs suppose some new gene of the human being discovered suppose some new genetically modified plant or animal has been discovered suppose some new drugs has been de developed through the help of recombinant dna technology so in that cases this will be helpful okay everybody fine uh, I'm very sure after this discussion, you would like to ask me, sir, what you will do in the case of current affairs. Listen, in this super props, I have also the planning, guys. It is already planned, not planning. It is already planned. What about the plan? In this plan, guys, I would like to discuss with you about the currents. In this, this is my science and technology part of discussion. So listen, guys. In this science and technology, I will give you the currents. Now your question, sir, how you will provide the currents? I will talk to the, uh, personally to the super prox team, head office. If they will provide the free class in that cases, neither it is not in my hand, guys, because I am already under the regulation and control under this body, guys. Now I am the part of this. Uh, listen, one thing, guys, I again want to tell you one thing. Uh, some, uh, somebody even asked me personally on this, my post through messages on the Facebook and whatever. Sir, sir, uh, how? Uh, I can find you all the lectures free listen guys here I will give you the answer you cannot find my all the lecture freely few of the lecture is just for the promotion of these video classes he those person who was going to teach you what about the quality of this faculty if everything you will find freely so what about these all the 200 300 crore setup the person who was going to earn near the person who have their own family members and all guys if I will, I have a demand of anything, even when you people are going to listen a teacher in an institution, that institution provide you freely. Tell me, tell me. Of course, no. So this is the reason, guys, don't ask me, sir, I, I want to find your all the videos freely. Even that videos are not in my hand, it is not my video, because here all the recordings are on the server. Here in this time, I'm in the lab, guys, and everything is going to be on their own server. So this is the reason, don't ask me this question. This is the, uh, you know, uh, very much well, different type of the question. In that cases, I, I, I have not any answers. Few you can find like ozone depletion, few which is in this promotion you people can find through internet, but not all the lecture, guys. So please don't ask me and be mature, guys. Nowadays, you are going for UPSC examination, be mature. Don't ask me this type of the question. Sir, where is this recording? You have it, you personally gave it. No, guys, here nothing is my personal. Here everything is what? It is It is a work for the organization. I am doing here a work for the organization, not for me only. So this is the reason these all the videos are not in my hand. It is not my video. Everything is on the internet this time, on the server. This time you are listening me on the YouTube. Now, this is also not with me. If this organization will upload it on this YouTube freely, in that case, you can find me. So for this, you should have to be take a subscription. And see guys, subscription is very cheap in this time. Very, very cheap guys. Even when the two, three friends will be collectively be collect na, and go for the pizza and burgers, you will pay more than 2,000, 3,000. Here you can find me the environmental ecology at the cost of 2,000, around 2,500. You can listen to the science and technology. And the most good part here, you are not going to waste your time in, in your particular at your home. Guys, you can listen to me at every moment of time when you are free at the night of 12. Okay, you can listen 12 to 4 my lecture. If you are, you are not sleeping, you are not have some tension of the science. You listen to me at every moment of time. When you are free, you listen to me once, twelve, three eyes, four, fourth, whatever you can type, you can revise. Because the teacher will never teach you three to four times in the institution. But the super pro of the videos, you can listen for three to four times. Okay, fine. Our here, guys, in the current parts. In this current parts, in this current parts, what will be your planning? What should be your planning? Listen, guys. Your examination, the mains paper of UPSC. 
it held in December everybody know December 2014 for your prelims examination I'm telling you prelims 2015 examination I will rec recommend you November 2014 to November 2014 to August 2015 this current affairs this current affairs you should have to update from Hindu newspaper okay everybody so my statement is here here in this case what about your importance here you focus the hindu newspaper the current affairs issues in november to august even listen guys thursday issue thursday issue is especially science and tech parts what about the recent updations what about the recent development this is here in the thursday issue so in this thursday issue what about the science and technology part you should have to cover second part so november to august 2015 23rd august is your examination so you should have to be prepared up to 15th august 2015 the question paper and 15 august everybody know what about this day second part i will tell you for the current affairs science reporter it will be also good to you um, now you will ask me sir which month of the science reporter here again i will tell you guys november 2014 to up to august 2015 you should have to read out the science reporter why science reporter why science reporter actually guys if you people see your question paper there were the many question came from science reporter and here i will give you the reason about the importance of science reporter science reporter is the government magazine not completely partially semi or semi i can tell you guys actually it is the publication of csir department what is csir council of scientific and industrial research autonomous research centers in this csir body is the nis car publications under this it work and it is a publication of nis car so it's a government body guys and it is the magazine is going to be published by csir and it is very very authentic guys I'm not very sure, but I am very sure in this aspect, guys. Your some of your UPSC examiner even even have written the some of the article in this what science reporter. And now you will ask me, sir, you prove. So how you 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 you, you, are, you have in this opinion that some of the UPSC examiner even write the science reporter? I have a proof, guys, and you can you people can check if I'm right or wrong. Listen. I am going to write some of the formations. Uh, you check guys have a information about the extinction of vultures. Extinction of vultures. You go and check guys designer poultry egg. Designer poultry egg. Sea bokthorn is the plant why the people are going to cultivate. In this way, guys, have a lot of questions you will find in these all the articles you will find into the science reporter. This is not only the few guys. I am telling you a lot of and even designer poultry. If you go and check, that was a question in 2011 and 12 or not in your mains paper, guys. So my statement is here because of this magazine, you, you will be very, very even helpful. Even it will be very, very helpful for your examination, especially to crack the examination. Now, what about the difficulty parts? Sir, in this time period, we are going to have a pressure. Of course, guys, you should have to be pressure. Even hona chahiye bacho. If you will not be have a pressure, so you will not focus your time period and you people will not be serious for an examination. And this is exactly the 70 days which play the very important role for your examinations. In this 70 days, if you utilize, you will clear the UPSC, neither you will wait for the again the next year. I am not telling you, you will not clear, but not next year, this year, in the next year. So in this time of the 70 days, you should be properly planned. Listen, of course, here a lot of the teacher will tell you, sir, polity may this current affairs, economy may this current affairs, history may this current affairs. See guys, here I'm going to give you the solution of my subject. Because here my area of focus is the science technology. In this, in this, through this channel guys, here I will give you some videos, updations. Of this all Hindi newspaper, Hindu newspaper issues from November 2014 to August 2015 where all the Thursday issue definitely I will cover and even some weekdays issues if you have any importance I will discuss with you. 
and even in the super blogs guys i will upload all the current affairs file of the hindi newspaper from november 2014 to august 2015 and all those facts here i will discuss with you through the help of ppt discussions so now the problem is solved if you people have to miss this november to august so don't worry guys here i will do it i will try to give you uh, some of the videos even freely guys similar to again for the promotions but that is a different part of the business you see here what about the important part of the studies this one and same thing guys i will also make a discussion of the science reporter november 2014 to august 2015 and here within the 3 to 4 hours what about the important issues and what about the relevant topics i will share with you of the hindi newspaper and the science reporter and then your science and technology will complete this will be enough guys for your examination so you should have to follow it now i would like to discuss your questions guys which i can find on the screen uh, listen in this webinar i am not going to discuss the topics okay everybody what about the questions i would like to discuss with you uh, just like uh, gurpreet has given me the question so means uh, we can uh, skip the september october of the current affairs right no guys in the current affairs if you have any material you should read out actually i will tell you one thing uh from 2 3 years from 2 3 years i got the got the question guys from last 2 uh, 3 years came in your paper see uh if you check the question paper of 2011 check the paper of 2012 check the paper of 2013 check the paper of 2011 2012 2013 2014 i am telling you if suppose in the last year do you know how much the question from current affairs there was a 20 question approx from the current affairs from the current affairs in this 20 question guys 10 question 10 to 12 question i am telling you okay fine 12 question you will find from this issue of november 14 to august 2015 but for 7 to 8 question guys what about in this earlier 2 3 years this is the main issue to all of you ab it is not possible ki you people even also go to read out the hindu newspaper for the science and technology and even the science reporter of 2 to 3 years it is not it is not possible so this is the reason here i will tell you guys you all people should have to prefer this 12 questions which are the relevant and the more important In this cases, guys, you should to be have a idea about the last two three years, and even in this, guys, seven to eight, guys, I'm telling you here five to six and one to two question, yeah, three question will be from the previous. What about the current and current in that period of six years, seven years back? So this is the reason, guys. Here my statement is: you should have to prefer mostly focus area. The main important areas in November 14 to August, and everybody know how much that this time the GS are important to you. Reason C side become as just a qualifying. Earlier what you people have done, guys. Earlier in that cases, guys, you people have just to read out what, uh, uh, just to prepare the C side in GS. Okay, okay, you clear the UPSC. But this time, guys, that is must to what. current affairs also here they have a good weightage and the current affairs is not as a current affairs guys interdisciplinary with the subject guys so my statement science and tech with the current affairs yes one more part i would like to discuss with you uh in biology part guys i will tell you one updation of the current affairs what is here under the current affairs one topic is also very very important about health and disease issues health and disease issues this is also very important why the health and disease issues are very important you listen here guys uh here guys in this health and disease issues what is this importance here uh some terminology nowadays are very very important some terminology 
what kind of the terminology again i am telling you this is not my discussion i am telling you the way of questions what about the standard this time what the upsc is going to create what the upsc want from your side you, but you are not going to be serious accordingly you know pandemic epidemic endemic what are the meaning of this is sporadic what are the meaning of all these stuff because uh, ebola pandemic epidemic endemic what is me meaning of these what about the terms guys this is very very important this time but what about your focus area you start to read out the uh, topics diseases disease uh, prevention disease control no 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 guys last year one question came do you know india got free from which disease even in this throughout the year i asked the question into the class guys india become free from which disease you know what was that question that question was even from my discussion i told you guys under the vaccination immunity programs vaccination program in the case of growing kids even this vaccination of the growing kid it is must to all of you sir but how i can understand sir guys uh, sir how it is possible because i am not married this time i have not a baby please guys it is not for you but it is important for even for you uh, for the future in that case even not for the future for your examinations so in this time i will tell you even you people should have to idea about the vaccinations in the case of growing kids guys immunity programs uh, vaccination program guys in this vaccination program guys lot of the vaccines have in this order i have given you the guess last year but question not came directly question came indirectly how this guys here in that cases lot of the vaccines order in this vaccines order those vaccine was not in the order it means india got free from this problem that is the reason this kind of the vaccinization is not going to happen in india so common sense common sense so my statement is here this type of the question is the recent scenario polio was not there again i am telling you because when i asked the question everybody said polio but when i have given the question you know option was there diphtheria option was there chicken pox option was there small pox and see guys chicken pox vaccine is here in india diphtheria vaccine is here in india but not the smallpox so india become free from the smallpox that was the question in your paper 2014 pre question came from this areas vaccinization question from this area super bug what are these this is the approach of upsc not the name of disease not the causing agent of disease not the symptom of disease not the medicine of disease okay this is the approach recent examination guys and see for this approach what about the important in this approach guys i this is the reason i am telling you you should have to check your question paper what is the superb superb is the new term what about ebola what about swine flu what about bird flu you know these all the topics were popular in the recent period of time some more diseases which were popular in the recent 3 4 years like encephalitis encephalitis like chicken guinea chicken guinea like meningitis meningitis even two diseases very common like aids like cancer even hepatitis these are those disease guys i am telling you superbug is a concepts not as a disease is a concepts modern days have a very very popular guys even tuberculosis this is also the problem guys so how many disease i mentioned here you guys you see in this recent period one ebola 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and 10 these are the important last year even in your mains paper guys i also give you the guess last year i have given 25 question in the guess guys and in these 25 guys there was a um three question came in your examination total four question came in the last year from the science and technology guys three came in your mains paper directly and the one question we directly came guys that was what that was a based on that uh, mdr and xdr you know mdr and xdr multi drug resistant extra drug resistance extremely drug resistance in the case of tuberculosis in every month if you read out the hindu newspaper you will find one or two article especially from the disease drug resistance in this tuberculosis concepts another point guys what is the super bug super bug even become very very popular from last 2000 uh, uh, from last 3 to 4 years guys 
सुपर बग इज ऑल्सो द कॉन्सेप्ट रिलेट टू द रेजिस्टेंस ड्रग रेजिस्टेंस even in the last uh, year guys i got a news uh, about the some of the some of the drugs which we people are going to use against the malaria disease again the human have got the resistance even this malaria pathogen got the resistance so human being have not any uh, even have a even the effect of the drugs so most of the human being again due to the loss of the what immunity they were going to die this is the modern approach of your examinations last year i guess a question guys see the modern approach tilt and non tilt technology tilt and non tilt tilt and non tilt and non tilt you know tilt and non tilt technology it is the technology of a what train which train super faster trains bullet train concepts and see you go and check the concept guys mrs in fact sorry maglev sorry maglev maglev vehicle If you people have seen your question paper, you know very well. Yes, sir. Question came from magnetic levitations. If suppose this is the track, guys. Okay, it is a friction-like condition, and that is the what? This is the distance of the train, है ना? From the track, and up to the certain distance because of Maglev concept, guys. Frictionless condition. This is the train is going to running there with up to 400 kilometer per hour, guys. 250, 300 kilometer per hour. That is the concept. Maglev vehicles, magnetic levitations. So what about the recent train? This is the recent train. What about the terminology of the diseases? What about the vaccination? India got free from and see a part of the guys. Even in the science and technology, don't think so. That is only pure science and technology. Here various schemes, various government organizations, various government programs. these are important part important topics for you just like i am going to ask you one question dots dots it's a government program even in state pcs question guys i got dots are given and here the name of disease for which which programs even in the case of diseases i will tell you guys suppose that is also the wonderful question for your paper suppose you psc as about the test test Well, even you people know, na you people go for this various kind of the tests, especially for the identification of the problems. What various kind of the tests? See, you know ELISA test, ELISA, ELISA test, enzyme linked immunosorbent assay for the AIDS. You know Western blotting. You see Western blotting, Western blotting. You know vital load test. Vital load test. Suppose UPSC have given you the question in the case of AIDS disease, yeah, HIV guys, HIV. Which test even used for the identification? So example, vital load one. The second is the Western Western blotting. Third is the ELISA. So what are the correct statement? One, one, two, one, two, three, all. So in that case, this is the recent trend of examination. Suppose similar to here, um, Vidal test. Vidal test for what? Typhoid. Typhoid. For dengue again have a test, guys. For malaria again have a test, guys. Even AIMS test, which is very very popular, AIMS test. This AIMS test is for the uh, cancer identification, cancer identifications. Somewhere you can find as a uh, malignancy test, cancer or malignancy test. Malignancy is the what? It's a layman term. More accurate is the AIMS test for the cancer test. Even in the case of AIDS, all the tests we are doing it, guys. If to any of the tests we can identify the person is suffering with HIV. This is the current trends. This is the current trends. Current trend means I am telling you 2011 onwards. But if you people see till 2010 question paper, question came from the name of diseases and their own pathogens. In these diseases have a viral diseases. In these diseases have a bacterial diseases. Which diseases are the transmitted by the fungi? Which diseases are transmitted by the protozoans? That was the part of discussion in that period of time. Ah, uh, see here, I got a question from Piyush, and uh, even the Abhishek. Ah. Uh, Vedika Mishra, even lot of the people have given me the question, guys. Uh, first of all, here uh, Abhishek, I can read out your messages. So please suggest any book, a uh, practice set, 
RLS previous year question paper are enough, RLS video is enough. <laughs> you people should have to be, uh, the you know what about the Abhishek your main problem. I think so you never join any institution. So Abhishek here I will give you uh, your answer. This video classes here in this uh, 45 hours of my science and technology over all the general science discussions. Here I am going to deliver the things which are important for you. Where have a maximum possibility to appear a maximum number of questions which happened in the previous years. So here through the help of videos guys it is the kind of even my, my statement you give me the answer. Okay. You first you think Abhishek. Okay. I am taking the class from last 13 years. This is my subject from last 20-25 years. From last 20-25 years, even I could not read out in the science and science and technology. Even I am also not enough for the science and science and technology. So how you? But what about the requirement of UPSC? What about the current scenario? It is a kind of guess. And here through the help of video guys, we try to give you our best through the help of certain guess. You know very well if you are you know uh, if you have done the graduation, sir. Yes, sir. In the sub, in a single subject, we have spent four years. In every institution, how much the, uh, how much a month you, you you people have to spend, sir? Five to six months, and you read out all the things: polity, economy, history, geography, science, and no, it is the kind of guess. And this guess is going to give you a what experienced person. Those person has given the maximum time with all of you. So my statement is here in this video classes in this time if you could not read out anything so that is enough for you. My statement Abhishek if suppose you earlier could not read anything. So this time if I will tell you you should have to read out the 8 to 8 to uh, 6 to 10th standard of the book. In that case I will tell you in this period of time you cannot finish the 6 to 10th standard of the book. So what about the best part you listen the video try to take a chance be confident and give the examinations. In this case, that is best. But for the whole studies and compilations, first of all, you should have to finish the 6 to 10th standard book. Then even my lecture, my lecture, you listen three to four times. When one time you will listen, so a lot of the term you will be interact. Okay, yes, sir. The first time I listen this term, again, the listen this term, listen this term. Because if you people have a background, you may not be this background. So most of the term will come first time for you in this biology. Even me myself has not the economy background. But when first time I read out the economy guys, I got okay, okay, this is GDP. This is green GDP. First time it was new to one. But next time when I read out what happened, it become easy to me. So what about here in this program guys? First you listen me. You read out the books. Again you listen me. Second time when you will again listen me guys, 70 to 80 percent you will share. So this is the concept here. So Abhishek, this is enough if you have a two month time and you want to crack this examination. Now, Piyush has sent me a message. Sir, as 12 biology books are so thick, could you please specify the chapter? In the case of 12 book guys, I will specify the chapter. Of course, it is very good uh, question. Uh, as a number of chapter this time is not to remember me but as a topics we should you should have to prefer there what is this uh, again i am telling you uh, according to piyush and even the avishek the same question which are here you listen uh, one more question, even the Abhishek, you asked me, uh, sir, what about the uh, practice set? For the practice set, guys, for the practice set, I will tell you, your previous year question paper is the best practice set for all of you. Why previous year question paper? This is this question has been developed by your examiner. When you people will read out your question paper guys in solve your question paper guys in that cases it will be very useful to you. You will understand what about the opinion of your examiner to develop a questions. What about the views of the examiner in your in, uh, uh, of your examinations. On this basis guys you will able to understand the core areas of the teachers. But it is not been identified by you even listen guys if suppose you will give me the sir you develop the questions. I'm going to make out the question. You know, 
I will develop a first question from my core areas where I have done my research work and a lot of the work I am doing. So when you will read out the question paper, UPSC question paper guys, so what you will find? You will find, okay, the core area of the teacher is this, this, this and this and this is the reason the teacher is going to ask the question from these areas. And the way of questions, even the various options, you know what about the main problem to you people guys? When you see a single question, have a A, B, C, D options. If you got, okay, this is the correct answer. So you never think why this is not, why this is not, why this is not. You should have to be follow or it is not as a one question. It is a four question if four options are given. Because why this is not the option. So this will be the answer for which question. This will be the answer for this which question. This is the answer for this question. It should be in your preparations. If 100 question is going to come in your paper and in 100 question total 400 options. So this is a 400 question you should have to be follow in your preparations. So the best is the UPSC question paper. Even uh, through super props, uh, even uh, some other even institution and even the question paper you can take. But see guys, how you will understand that is authentic or not. That is the main issues. Even to show out my quality, I am very good teacher, I am very excellent, very intelligent teacher. I can develop a lot of questions hey na? and you people are not uh, even not known that questions. In that cases, you will have an issue. Even the question have not any limitation guys. Anybody can develop any question. In that cases, the people will attract you. You are not able to understand this question. So you don't know anything. In that case, you cannot clear. So this is my reason you should have to follow your UBSC question paper. This is authentic and this what? Strategy, your preparations, everything will be accordingly. You should have to be follow this one. Even listen, you know, when I take the classes in the institution, I always try to prefer to solve your question paper. Even at the end day, last day, I even talk to the students. Even from the beginning of my class, guys, from the beginning of my class, even the first day I introduced the question paper. Reason to show the standard of your examination and why my study, why my teaching and everything is accordingly. Reason is the standard of your question paper and because of this you are able to solve around 70% question this time. Uh, in this 12 biology book, what about the relevant uh, chapters? Listen guys. Actually, again, I will tell you one thing. If you are the non-science background, non-science background, you should start from 6th to 10th standard of the science book. It's not very difficult, guys. 6th, 7th, 8th, 9th, 10th, within a week, you can finish if every day you will give hardly 3 to 4 hours. When this will finish, 6th to 10th standard, I will tell you, you should have to be revised 3 times in 3 months. And always prefer guys if take a pen or marker and underline, underline, underline. Next time when you are going to read out, you will know, okay, this is a focus area and you should have to be idea about it. Because next time you we will mark, mark it. So again, you will take the maximum time to finish it. After the 6th to 10th standard of the book, guys. If you want, in that cases, you can go 11th and 12th standard. 11th and 12th standard. Here again, I will tell you guys, old NCRT was good. It is a, a lot of debate, even the even the students, sir, old or new. Here I will tell you, old NCRT was many times better, guys. A lot of the shopkeeper even can provide you the old NCRT. Okay, everybody, excuse me. So I was here guys, I told you in this uh, 11 to 12 uh, old NCRT book uh, is good, but not every chapters, but not every chapters. Uh, here in that cases guys, 11 to 12 old NCRT, in this 12th, in this 12th, uh, 11 and 12, you see where is the animal physiology, where is animal physiology. That animal physiology, you go and read out, except two chapters. One, respiratory system, no need to, for the studies, it is not required. And the one is something about, uh, I not recall, okay, sorry. So, this is, you left it, and rest of animal physiology is very, very important. 
दिस इज एंड वन मोर पार्ट आई विल टेल यू गाइस इकोलॉजी एंड एनवायरमेंट इकोलॉजी एंड एनवायरमेंट अब यू विल आस्क मी सर दिस इज अ साइंस एंड टेक्नोलॉजी सेशन सो वाई यू आर गोइंग टू टेल द इकोलॉजी एंड एनवायरमेंट इवन इन द ट्वेल्थ स्टैंडर्ड ऑफ द साइंस बुक इन दिस लास्ट सिक्स चैप्टर्स are given in this ecology and environment issues it is also very good you should have to prefer it it will be good to you so in this 11 and 12 i will prefer only the animal physiology part not other uh, one more part guys here in this 11 and 12 books application of biotechnology is also one of the part application of biotechnology is also one of the chapter you should also prefer it okay everybody so these two chapters i will tell you the whole animal physiology where is the animal systems are given there and in the application of biotechnology is also one of the chapter you should have to prefer these two now so ncert is uh, it enough that is the uh, surya sent me the messages is it enough to have a base what you are talking about yes of course that is a base guys if you have a non science background even if you have a science background you should also have to read out the 6 to 10th standard of the ncert book in the case of 11 and 12 you should have to follow animal physiology ecology environment but old ncert guys because in the old ncert you will find six chapter from ecology and environment but in the new ncert have only four chapters of the 12 in the 12 standard book old you go and search in that case it is not my issues and yes of course application of biotechnology now i would like to the discuss your question questions here guys which i can uh, see on your screen guys uh uh vedika asked me a question vedika mishra sir after uh, our subscription is over we will getting information see this is not my part of discussion that will be uh, that answer will even give uh, by the uh, super prof stream here uh, my topic of discussion is only your question question discussion guys even the topic discussion not about the subscription and this part so uh, but sir we hardly have a time how will be read 6 to 12 in such short time yes the same thing i am telling you guys priyanka here the i am telling you in this two month the better part is you just listen the videos three to four times and in this video you just try to uh, listen two to three times and try to revise everything and give your answer give your paper guys reason in this two month period you cannot read out all the 6 to 12 standard book so you take a chance you trust on the god you listen you give your best best and give the examinations so the best part in this period of time in this two months it is not possible to read out the 6 to 10th standard but see first you take a chance and give the examinations because of these videos only here in these videos we also try to give you the current affairs part so don't worry in my part definitely you will fully satisfy because in my discussion part of the video lectures you will find maximum part is according to your question paper discussions oh accordingly every lecture is according to your question paper based it is not on my basis of my knowledge and my own um, uh, standards so in this period of time that will be good to you i think you people are not any question in this time and uh, so i would like to stop here guys and uh, through the help of this uh, webinar i would like to meet you time to time definitely in the next time guys when i will come and meet you so in that time i will inform you and you people send me some mails that mail even the super prof team will inform you you send the messages there and in that the next time of the webinar i would like to connect with the uh, maximum people of the india guys and try to solve your papers on the basis of your requirement i will time to time discuss your question paper and give you the time period in with this time in the my topic of discussion my part of discussion of this person and this person and this person so thank you guys and before going to stop here i would like to give you my number in this number super pros will give you the particular time you people can call me if you are going to take the subscriptions thank you so much guys uh, my number you see here that is the this one even you people can also leave me the messages through whatsapp or whatever every moment of time i am not able to give your answer but yes of course when i will be i will be free and if i found it that is a genuine question and here i should have to give your answer because most of the time i have seen guys in my facebook you people send me the message sir what should be the our strategy what should, what should our our read out the material every for this everything guys you should have to seen this youtube 
in this youtube and all the webinars you can find time to time because through the masses guys it is not possible to give you the all the info, all all but you have the information and the another part guys through the call it is also not possible because throughout the day i am busy and busy but here through the help of super boss i will provide you one or two hours you people can call me in that particular time and i will try to give your uh, answers and even another thing you people can also connect through my um um facebook i will try to inform you and time to time you send me the message i will try to give the answer and you can find me a uh, facebook with the name of ravi agrari so thank you everybody good day i think so you people have to enjoy uh, i will meet you soon guys i will definitely miss you and would like to meet you always and time to time i will try to give you some updates in this topic so thank you good day guys allah hafiz bye I thank you Ravi Agrawal sir for uh, giving us some, such wonderful lesson on UPSC civil service preparation but I would like to add few more things before you wind up the session which is very important now there are two things that we people normally discuss is when we talk about the science general science or any other topic we need to understand that concept and facts are two important part of anything or any understanding for example if i talk about uh, the telecommunication part so you know that there is 4g so a lot of people actually talk about what is 4g okay there will be people who are talking about 3g there will be people who are talking about 5g there will be people who are talking about 2g but i have seen it has been a very rare occurrence when people talk about say 1g or maybe 0g some of you might be surprised that what is 0g what is 1g so the concept is that when we are going to study about the entire subject we need to understand that there should be a balance between a concept and a fact for example a lot of you are aware of the important topic like ballistic missile and a cruise missile how many of you can actually differentiate what is a ballistic missile and what is a cruise missile now this is a more of a conceptual question that you should understand and when you can understand you can understand the merit of the technology that being used as well for example if i say ballistic missile is one missile in which the missile travels into the outer space and then reenters at earth atmosphere to strike its target but the cruise missile is one which is always there on what always in the atmosphere it never leaves the earth atmosphere and that is why it does not have to carry its own oxygen and that is why there is a difference between concept and a fact try to understand with, with that when you are understanding a concept be it a science technology concept or economy or polity or geography or history that we should pay attention to what the concept is upsc has been focusing on concept and a lot of people actually say that upsc paper has gone from factual to conceptual and they say that say 40 to 50% of the paper is conceptual and 60 or maybe 40% is factual but i tell you one more thing that this concept part is instrumental in solving the question of the fact part as well for example if you understand what tropical cyclones are then you will be in a position to understand or define why tropical cyclones are named like that recently we talked about hudud there were so many news about how the uh, the tropical cyclones are being named so when you are studying something when you are understanding something it is very important for you to understand that we have to develop concept first and fact later lot of you while studying focus on the concept part but rather pay a lot of attention on the fact part because it is easy to revise talk and communicate try to focus on the concept part superprof.com which has created this course has focused on the conceptual part of it and that is why 25 30 or 35 hours of lecture empower you with those tools that actually can help you define a lot of question on the fact part and that is why this whole system becomes very important for all of us now what is more important is to understand that we have to apply this approach to all the other subject for example there has been news about ebola there has been news about polio there is a no news about many other diseases but what is there in terms of the question from the upsc upsc will be asking question in terms of what the conceptual part is 
when India became polio free. Now, when you say polio free, then we can ask a question like how many countries have become polio free in the last one decade or we can also ask the question like what is the criteria for de declaring a country polio free. Now, these are the things that we need to pay more attention to. Now, when we are talking at superprofs.com, superprofs.com while creating courses has taken help from the teachers who are an who are expert in their own respective areas and they have done the similar kind of delivery in this part as well. And I tell you that this is one of the easiest way where you can revise what you have gone through. You can orient yourself about the subject, about the paper and you can get the best output from this entire discussion. I thank you on behalf of the super profs to be a participant in this effort and let this event a big success. I thank you.